Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got a multi-chrome gradient. Yes. I have started off with Miltix Formula 2 and China Glaze's Liquid Leather. You could use any black cream. I topped it off with the Pro FX Quick Dry, and I've applied my liquid latex. Today, I'll be using these ILNP polishes. I love nail polish. And this is Synergist Loop and Nostalgia. And I had been wanting to do this for a while. And you can tell my bottles are old because they haven't done bottles like these in years. I've got my little sponge and it's already dampened with some water. And I'm just going to apply these two colors about halfway on each end of this sponge. And that's, you know, people have asked if really doing the water makes a difference. And, you know, I just believe it does. I just believe that it really does make a difference on how much polish the sponge pulls up you know I mean it just it seems to take less polish for me and less rounds when I do it this way and you can see I've totally messed up and I've put the wrong color on the wrong end but I assure you with these polishes and this manicure it was fine it just worked out fine we all make mistakes and luckily this one was very noticeable <laughs> but after doing the tapping it's really hard to tell on the sponge what's what and what went where and I'm just tapping and you know, I, I go over more than one nail when I do this. I do like all of them, and I try to start with different ones and go through the line. That way they're getting the coverage. You know, everybody's getting about the same amount of coverage. I know I'm a little chatty today. I apologize. I might have had too much caffeine. <laughs> so here we go. Just applying that on there. And I really love this one. Just like my last manicure that I wore for five days. I also wore this one for five days. And uh, that's kind of close to a record for me. So that's how much I love them. And I think I'm going to do another round. And that's the thing I love about gradients is you just keep doing it until you're happy with it. Um, as far as this goes, I don't really know that you're going to notice much of a difference in this, this round. Um, you could probably get away with one or two rounds over all the nails for a gradient and, you know, it'd be fine, but I just was playing. <laughs> I just kept going because, you know, I had on my latex. Why not? Love duochromes, multi-chromes. So here we go. We're going to peel this latex off. Hopefully I can get it to, to come off. There we go. And I've got just some dried nail polish there. That's not even latex, just dried polish. And I am going to go in with my little cleanup brush. This is that little e.l.f. cleanup brush that I'm using. And some acetone. And I love how well these duochromes clean up. I mean, they're just not smearing all over my fingers. And I like that. And I love these. I, I, they're so hard to photograph, though. That's the only problem with playing with duochromes is getting all those ships. And I don't even believe I covered all of it in my swatch photos at the end. Um, I'm going to put some northern lights on this because, you know, just in a northern lights kind of mood. I love how it gives you such a soft, hollow, scattered, hollow effect, but it doesn't take away from the manicure. And I'll be honest, it has saved so many of my manicures. Look at that. Ah! Oh. Love it. Just like that. Love it. But you know I'm going to stamp on it. I am. First, I'm going to top it with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. And no, I'm not sponsored by them. Um, I'm going to just get this to dry down and get ready for some stamping. Look how, oh, I just love it. <laughs> love it. There's Woody. Hey, Woody. Look at there. Blingtastic, chromy madness, love it. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a little bit of accent stamping. I'm not gonna go too crazy on this one. I was hoping I could show y'all the change. It's like green and yellow on the tips, and I'll be using this Bundle Monster Kelly Marissa plate again. I just had this out, and I'll be using my Bundle Monster monocle stamper and my Bundle Monster scraper. Nicole Diaries, Silver, and Beauty Big Bangs, Gold. And I'm going to do kind of like a smushy stamp here. I'm just going to put blobs on the plate and smush them together. Get my, my, you know, gold and silver all in one. Yay! 
so happy to have my monocle stamper back. The other stampers have been working fine, but you know, when you get hooked on something, you're just hooked on it. Love it. There, you, know, you can see that green yellow there. Woo! So here we go. We're going to do that again. I'm putting this only on my thumb and my ring finger today. So there we go. Beautimus. I just love it. Ugh. Pro FX again. Here we go. Top coat time. And I, I'm, I know y'all heard me gush. I love this one. You're going to get three swatch photos this time. And I hope you enjoyed this one. I would love to hear your thoughts on it. Um, that's it without the stamping. Just had to get those in there. You know, some of the color changings. And here's the final manicure. So leave me a comment. And I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.